Hey, what's new YouTube? Sway JTV here with a brand new video today. And today I'm gonna be going through my wave journey of how I got waves and what my waves are looking like right now. Um, I actually watched Brumman TV just do this and I got inspired. I said, you know what? Why not show my waves off? Why not show my waves off too? But anyways, hopefully you guys like this video. Subscribe down below and leave a comment of what I should do next. But without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, so let me give y'all a backstory on my weaves, on my weave process in the beginning. So I had been growing my hair out for two years because I wanted the twist. You know, everybody got the twist nowadays. Everybody got the fro, the big hair. Everybody got that. So I wanted that look and I had it. Um, I'll probably post some pictures up on the screen right here, right there, so you guys can see it. But I had a lot of hair. I'm talking about a lot of hair, or not a lot, a lot. You know, nothing crazy. But you know, I had, I had, I had a lot of hair. I had enough, enough hair. And you know, I decided in March that it was time to let it go, um, and start fresh. Cause why not? And um, yeah, the day I cut my hair. I was actually going through it with my mom. I was like, ah, should I cut my hair? We and her were like debating. And she was like, yeah, I think you should cut your hair. And you know, moms are always right, bro. Like, like I don't know, it's something about moms. Like whatever they say, it, it's it's like always correct somehow. I don't know how. Is it, am I the only one that experiences that? Like your mom will say to do something and you do the opposite and the opposite doesn't work out for you. But you know. I don't know, bro. But my mom told me to cut my hair. And, you know, I listened to her. And, you know, I took the step. And I did. I cut my hair. I went to the barbershop, cut my hair. I see my hair falling from my head. I was like, yo, what am I doing? And when it was done, I just knew. And I went back to school, bro. Oh, my God. It was going to be hell when I went back to school. So, I was nervous, you know what I'm saying? Um, what people were gonna think about me, what people was gonna say. And my mom was like, don't worry about what other people think. Just be you, just be who you are. And I was still scared. Cause like, I had a lot of hair. And of course, as soon as I walk into school, I took like, I took like two steps from the parking lot, bruh. They was on me, oh my goodness. They said, no. No, Jordan cut his hair, Jordan cut his hair, no. I had people literally screaming, no. Like, no, why would you cut your hair? Like, dang, it's my hair. Well, I didn't know you cared that much, dang, you know what I'm saying? Why, where was this attention at, you know, when I had hair? But, you know, a lot of people was um, caught off guard that I cut my hair. A lot of people thought I wouldn't ever cut my hair. And, you know, I did, I took the first step. That was the first step, cutting my hair off. The second step was getting waves now. This was a journey. And um, my waves are pretty good right now. I'm not gonna say like they crazy or nothing. You know, some of them don't connect on, especially on like, I think my right side. Right side doesn't connect. That's my weak side. That's definitely my weak side. But I was going crazy. I was getting do-rags, um, wave brushes. And, you know, a whole bunch of stuff to wave cream, a whole bunch of stuff to get my hair to lay down. Because that's really what waves are. It's just getting your hair to lay down and, you know, a wavy pattern. So that's what I was doing. And it took a minute, you know. It was a lot of, uh, it's a lot of hard nights. I felt like giving up a lot of times. Sometimes I did give up, you know. I just wanted to grow my hair back out at one point. And, you know, I just cut it off again. So it was definitely a couple like, oh my goodness, bro. It was definitely a lot of moments where I wanted to quit. I wanted to give up, but I kept going. I kept sticking through it. And that should teach you something about life too. Like, don't ever quit. If it's something that you like, don't quit, don't give up. Keep going, keep pushing through times. It's not supposed to be easy. It's not supposed to be easy, you know what I'm saying? It's supposed to be hard. It's supposed to be a challenge. You know what I'm saying? I challenged myself by trying to get waves. And I got waves now. You know what I'm saying? I got waves. You know, all the girls at school, they was they was laughing. When I cut my hair, they said, they was laughing at me. And, you know, I was being embarrassed. I was very embarrassed. They was laughing at my face. You know what I'm saying? And 
I can tell you, man, I got weaves, bro. I'm not even gonna speak about the girls. <laughs> I'm not even gonna talk about the <laughs> yo. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna speak on the ladies. That's that's the time for a different different video, different video. But yeah, you know what I'm saying. Always stick to what you're good at and what you like to do. You know what I'm Never quit. But yeah. So I'm gonna show you my weaves in a second when I go to the bathroom. Uh, right now I'm about to show you some products I use. I use this. Now I know some of I watch like a lot of wave tutorials, a lot of wave videos. Y'all be getting in depth what kind of brush to use, medium, soft. Um I believe this is a this is a medium brush. This is definitely a medium brush, not soft brush. A soft brush is a lot soft. This is a medium wave brush that I use to brush my hair. Um, this is my main go-to brush. I have another one, which is, you know, the other one is just a regular brush. But, you know, this is, this is the real deal. This was about like $20. Plus, I use this, the Curl Hansen Smooth Cream, whatever. I use this and I use some I forgot to get it. I use, I use sporting waves, but I don't use sporting waves every day. Um, I usually use this every day to, you know, moisturize my hair and uh, get it to lay down. But yeah, that's what I use. And I got a couple do rags. I'm pretty sure y'all seen them in the videos. Cause I'll be wearing do rags in like all my videos. <laughs> I, I don't think. No, actually, I wore. I didn't wear a do rag in the rating my followers video. I didn't wear a do rag. But yeah, I've been wearing a lot of do rags in my videos. A do rag and a hoodie, you know what I'm saying? That's the, that's, <laughs> no, I say that's the go-to in my videos. You know, you always gonna see me in that do rag and a nice clean hoodie or a nice clean shirt. You know what I'm saying? But I know y'all anxious. I know y'all waiting to see what my waves look like. So I'm about to show you. Let's head to the bathroom. All right, so we in the bathroom right now. As you can tell, you know what I'm saying? If you watch my Ten Essentials, y'all already know. Y'all boys already know. I'll put y'all on. I'll put y'all on. No need to thank me, though. No need to thank me. But I'm on my, I'm on my knees right now. Pause, pause. I'm on my knees right now because, you know, your boy's a little tall. So if for, for, in order for y'all to see the waves, I got to, you know what I'm saying? I got to... Do what I gotta do, basically. But let's get into it. Um, I'm gonna take my do rag off now and show y'all. So let's do. It. And I'll probably get the camera and zoom in even more. Oh boy. Yeah, probably get a mirror too. So this is what the can y'all see? Hold up, let me grab the camera. Grab the camera real quick. This oh my god, hopefully y'all can see. Hopefully y'all can see. Oh boy. Uh, let's look in the look in the mirror. Oh boy, they spinning. Look. Yo, look at them. Oh yeah. Look at the back, look at the side. Turn it over. Oh boy, I got big acne on my face. Oh yeah. I wish I could show you the back. I think my back looks, hold up. I'm trying to show you the back. Hold up. Hoodie right now is blowing me. Okay. Yes, sir. That's the back. You know what I'm saying? My waves ain't nothing crazy. I'll probably put a pic in the video too to show you all my waves on Instagram. I got a couple of pics. But yeah, my waves not looking too bad. Yeah. Yeah, I got a lot of decorations in my bathroom, y'all. Don't mind that. But, yeah. 
basically that's what my waves are looking like you know it wasn't the best you know I, it wasn't the best hair reveal it was kind of hard trying to show y'all but y'all get the gist bro y'all can see i can see that they in there and they laying they laying bruh i can see that they in there and they laying kind of All right, so now I'm about to show y'all how to get waves if you want to start out um, and get waves. How to get waves. So the number one key, number one key, do not, do not waste money. Now, what I mean by that is don't buy a whole bunch of brushes. Don't buy a whole bunch of creams and don't, don't buy a whole lot. Cause you know, you're going to get discouraged real fast and you're going to be like, yo, I got all these products and I'm not getting no waves. Like what's going on? So, you know, don't do that. Don't buy all those products, you know, start out with a basic brush. If you got one and just brush your hair, you know, I'm pretty sure y'all boys know how to brush your hair, but let me show y'all so this way, straight down for the top, straight back. For the back, for the sides, like this, to the side, for the other side. I'm holding, I'm holding the camera so I can't do the other side. But like this, straight down. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Like that. You should always moisturize your hair, too. Um, you don't have to get this because this is like. This was like $14. So if you want a budget, if you want a budget, I say go ask your mom. Go in your mom room. Because my mom be having products too. So, and I'll be going in there stealing stuff. Or asking her. Um, you know, how to moisturize my hair. How to get my hair, you know, smooth. And, you know, not looking dry. And stuff. So, yeah. That's, that's just ask your mom. Or go in her room for a product. Pretty sure she got something. That will moisturize your hair. If you don't want to buy the, the uh, shea butter. The shade moisturizer But yeah man That's my waves I had just got a cut too So hopefully it was looking fresh and crispy Hopefully it was looking fresh and crispy But yeah Anyways guys That's gonna be the end of this video Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video And if, if you're an aspiring waver Go ahead Why not Why not get waves man Especially since it's summertime You know Nobody wants to have all that hair I mean, don't get me wrong, the hair looks great. I'm not gonna knock the hair, because I definitely was rocking it. And I like the twist, the twist was tough. If that's the only thing like that I regret. Cause I wanted to like actually like, I wanted to actually like have like dreads and stuff. But you know, a lot of people got that. And you know, nothing goes, you know, you always look clean with a clean cut, you know what I'm saying? Clean cut, hair gone. And yeah, I don't think in the near future, I'm a. I've been thinking about growing back out. I've been thinking about growing back out, but I don't, not right now though, not right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm liking the waves, I'm liking the cut. Only thing about this, you definitely have to get haircuts like every two weeks, cause you're gonna look crazy. I'll be looking crazy. But when you get that fresh cut, when you get that line up right, when you get that fresh cut, you feel like, Oh my gosh, you feel like you want you feel like LeBron James, bruh. You feel, you feel like Kyrie Irving, bruh. You feel like a god. I'm telling you. You'll feel like a god. Anyways, that's the end of this video. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe down below. And I'm out.